What's up guys, it's your boy Swayze Baby and welcome back, I miss you guys. And as you can tell by the title, today we are letting NBA player points decide what we eat for 24 hours. So what we're gonna do is Guy loaded up some games. Your boy hasn't had internet at all. Like zilch, nada, nothing. My data bill is crazy. I had this idea and I wanted to do it fast, so today it's just gonna be dinner. But comment down below, your boy will do NFL, touchdowns, I'll do the whole day because you know, I'm, I'm indecisive. Which means I can't really make up my mind pretty easy, so why not let the NBA players, the superstars, the hard work, the dedication they put into getting buckets decide how much your boy spent. But before we do that, you guys been commenting, yo Ryan, let's see the new house, let's see the new house. For those who've been asking, your boy moved to Toronto with Jad, aka Chad with a J. Don't worry, we're gonna be flying back and forth, filming with all the boys and all that. So here's probably the quickest house tour you've ever seen. Got the setup right here, but I have no internet, so it's been a black screen for the last three days. Here's a small look at your boy's room. Got my own little auntie right here. You already know the brush game wavy waves coming soon with the sporting wave. The, I, I don't know why I'm showing you my toiletries. Moving on, you got your boy got a walk in. You know, at the old house, you had to walk in. Here are all the kicks, all this stuff, all the clothes, the drip, the drip, 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 drip. Soon to come drip, 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 drip. So leaving the closet, we got a little bit more drip outside and here is the living room some dusty vibes got the Harman Kardon speaker right here shout out Harman Kardon we got we got Dr. Hobbs luggage here because he's already bumming off the house so a nice little design you know fun fact I put that there you know makes it look extra nice you know like see see what I did there except Dr. Ugly's duck to bag in my way all here we got a nice little balcony a little ducky I don't think anyone's been out here in the two days that we've been here got a nice little couch internet that don't work this doesn't work this has been beyond stress moving on just the couch living room we're gonna add more stuff it's been two days we try to mount a big dutty TV onto the wall and the guy came in and messed up our wall I don't know if you can see that on camera oh my god look how dutty that is all he did was drill holes and told us we couldn't wall mount anything so that is over this is just the kitchen vibes more little drip dirty drip everyday drip this is gonna be Jad's desk I'll let him show you that and that's Jad's room over there it is a condo so there's not so much I could show you but it's spacious that's why we picked this place it's very very spacious banger videos are gonna be filmed we got a nice DIY kitchen this is where I'm gonna be chilling you know mostly editing here or falling asleep on here but I can't wait to start filming more I actually took a break kind of not a break it's been four days I like to upload every two to three days I haven't uploaded in like four to five days but that is gonna be changing your boys going crazy merch coming out soon a bunch of stuff coming out soon but yeah I just want to give you a little update on your boys life you know I haven't just vlogged and just talked to the camera in a while it's always challenges it's always videos these days but boys life now Toronto vibes comment down below Toronto Big Dutty Toronto vibes. We're in Toronto. Dr. House. What up, Dr. House? We got what Dr. Up, House in the building. Bro, YouTube been treating you good. This place is beautiful. <laughs> You've been what? treating me good, man. You have to move your Dutty ass luggage. You actually, that's, I, I roasted you for putting it there, but. It's clean and perfect. <laughs> and my luggage is Italian because I'm half Italian. But right now we're in Toronto, and what you don't have, Ryan, is internet in this beautiful house. Yeah. But I have internet yeah. from my phone. No. Only <laughs> Snake you know. ass. Literally, Guy has been streaming off his phone because he hasn't used his data. And me, I have unlimited data. But once it hits 20 gigs, for people who don't use their phone, that's a little cringy. But your boy used 20 gigs this month. And then it goes like to slower internet. So I had internet, but it was dumb slow. My internet is dumb fast. <laughs> so Guy has been <laughs> controlling my power. I, the thing is, I have the power, bro. I can do anything I want my laptop. What are you going to do? There's no TV. <laughs> there's no internet. No Wi-Fi. No nothing. So but you're the man of the hour. Shout out to Dr. Hobbs. Yep. Shout out to me. Because you man. love control and you love taking advantage of your friends. That's very uh, wrong. You made me build this couch. You made me put <laughs> no. a lot of. I put all your room together in your bed. No, you free. did not. You did not. That, I'm but a friend. that's what I am. A great friend. <laughs> <laughs> As I mentioned, Doctor Hobbs has the power, and he's gonna be picking the NBA. So it's kind of Doctor Hobbs the size of E. But he's gonna be picking the game. Games. I've been watching way more NBA than you. First of all, I have internet. The past two days, <laughs> so many teams I've been playing. I'm winning in fantasy. I don't know if you guys know what fantasy is. I'm winning in basketball fantasy. Yeah, low so, key, Doctor Hobbs is actually. Pretty 
pretty good in fantasy. So once again, comment down below for a part two where I'm gonna do this 24 hours and live. Like, the game will be live, but for now, Dr. Hobbs is gonna pick a game. A game? I'm gonna watch most of the highlights, see how much the player scored, because I haven't watched ball in three days. Like, I haven't seen nothing. So he's gonna pick a game, and the leading scorer of that game, that's how what I'm gonna spend on. But for part two, I'll probably watch a game live, and then go out to eat for breakfast, lunch, dinner, so comment down below if you wanna see that. But now, kinda in your hands, Dr. Hobbs. In my hands, I've been watching, there's three games. Okay, yeah, before, before, we, before we do this, I got a little basketball trivia for you. For me? For I'll you. For you too. Okay, <laughs> okay. Go ahead. For Clay Thompson, yeah. Steph Curry had another very superstar counterpart, yeah, an all-star. Draymond Green. Nope, but no, oh. no. Before him, who is Steph Curry's first teammate that was an all-star? Giannis Akatakumpo. Oh my God, no, no, no. No? Any, any clue? Yep. Oh, okay. Damian Lillard. Oh my God. So as you guys know, Guy does not know basketball that well. His name was Monte Ellis. Yeah, the little short guy. <laughs> right, the little light-skinned guy. And, oh, okay, wow, I'm okay. actually shocked you knew that. That's Michael Jordan middle name, right? Um, um. <laughs> that's not that basketball related, but Steven. I'm gonna. <laughs> Michael Steven Jordan. Okay, Guy. So, has three games lined up, just the highlights, but you come up with a way that I could just pick any of the. Uh, so like a random, a random um, uh, pickup. Like, I'm gonna give you three numbers. Listen, what's gonna happen. I'm gonna give you three numbers. Okay. Every number has a game in my head that I'm, I was watching. And number you're picking, <laughs> don't, the game. You don't watch basketball, so. I, I've been watching basketball. LeBron James scored 27 points on Steph Curry's head. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, is that one of the games? No, nope, that oh. is not one of the games. Okay, so three but games. A lot, a lot of money and less money. I got it. Pick uh, a number. Pick a number. Me. All right, so three games. I do not know the scores. Scores, I don't know who's playing. This is random. This is random. This is the whole point. Because I don't want to choose. I'm choosing the number. I'm going to go with three. I always go with the highest number. <laughs> you should go with the middle number. A, B, C, you pick C, B. I pick two. Uh, the two was least money. Okay. I pick two. It was Steph Curry. It was, he has 12 points. The whole game. But number three is James Harden. James Harden! <laughs> no, no, no. All right, guys, so I'm gonna sit here and watch this shortened version. This is not the length of the entire game. This is literally just a dumbed down version of how many points James Harden is scoring. I'm gonna watch this, it's about 10 minutes, and I'll keep you updated on how much. I could Google it right now, but I'm not gonna Google it. I actually wanna see how he's scoring points, how many points he has at a certain time, but um, let's start watching this. I could show, I don't wanna show you too much because it's copyright. If I, I played this, like, you know, you see a little bit of it, but not. Nah, I'm gonna watch it by myself, and I'll keep you all updated. Oh my God, okay, I literally just turned on the game. It is 7-2, and this is the first thing I see. A duck, he stepped back a, uh, on his head top. He already has five of the first seven points, and your boy's stressing. Halfway through the game, and your boy is uh, spending money. Bradley Beal and James Harden are going off against each other. James Harden already has 22 at half. So if, uh, if the game ended right now, your boy would have to spend 22 bucks on a meal, which isn't bad. But James Harden not only scored 22, he'd be averaging 30. Bradley Beal, if I did both of them, I would be spending like 100 bucks right now. This game's actually very interesting. My assumption is that he's gonna have around probably a 40 bomb. 20 at half, math times two, you know, keep it up. A nice little 40 bomb. What happened to the NBA? What happened to the NBA? I want to show you the game. If you haven't watched this game, you should go watch it. Everyone's draining everything. I want to show you too much, but I can't. It'll be copyrighted. NBA, give me give me some league pass so I can show my fans the game. Then just watch it here inside the NBA. I'm just kidding. But what the hell is wrong with the NBA? Look at this score. Houston has 125. Washington has 135. James Harden passed the 40. I think he's at like 48 now. They haven't given a score update. Boy spending money, money today. So I think it's gonna be capped around this 48. That's enough, that's enough. Yo, 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 yo. I, I, I brought it back. I'm just watching the game. He went off. He literally scored the last 10 points. Listen to this. Listen to how much, this is how much I'm spending on dinner tonight just because of James Harden. I, why three? What did, what the, the I, 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 I don't, I don't know why this is one of the games that he picked. He wants your boy to spend money, but listen to this. Harden is now at 59, he's 17 or 17 at the line. Remember, no timeouts remaining for the Wizards. Oh my God! And you heard it there, ladies and gentlemen. Today, your boy has to spend $59 at dinner. Shout out to James Harden. <laughs> Amazing game. Go watch that game if you haven't already. But that's how much money I'm spending. So let's see what we can get 
for $59 on one meal. Comment down below if you guys want to see a part two and I'll do every single meal, but for now, let's see what we get. All right, guys, so it's a little bit later, as you can tell. It's a little dark because it's my city. I'm oh, back in Toronto. Toronto, Toronto oh. vibes. I'm wrapping the Drake over your shirt. You see the I'm Toronto, Toronto. vibes? Some Scotiabank Arena there. Rogers Center there. But more importantly, your boy is kind of stressed because 59 bucks on food is a lot. So I didn't eat till super late. But let's see what we can get for $59. Your boys are going to real sports bar. If you're from Toronto, you know, should be called the best sports bar. There's football going on. So I was like, yo, why not watch some football? Because we already watched a little bit of basketball. He is looking for Wi-Fi. I'm a tourist, my <laughs> He is looking for, he, he's looking for Wi-Fi because we haven't had Wi-Fi yet. Walking in the restaurant and I see this. Let's go, baby. Or should I say, what it do, baby, and why the hell am I red? But, oh my God, big duck kebabs. All right, so we got the football playing in the background. Now we have to check the menu and add this shit up. The prices are kind of beans, so this shouldn't be too hard. Okay, you already know I'm getting some wings. Oh my God, that looks 17 for wings kind of zooped get a little entree some share balls get you hungry up, or are you super blurry oh my god i need your help eating this food though yes oh dinner's on you tonight dinner's on me tonight okay actually man. no it's on what i spent looking at the menu i think i'm gonna go with the nachos and add wok add some chicken might get some brisket that's already 30 bucks right there might get a pound of wings this is vibe i don't know how i'm gonna finish this but i got my boy Guy. So I might actually have to share. All right guys, so I'm literally doing the math here. So I'm thinking of getting nachos and adding every single item. So it is 21 plus five plus five. So that's brisket and smoked chicken. You have to get the guac and that's already $35. Then I'm thinking of also getting chicken wings. So that's another 17 and we are at $52. So seven more dollars needs to be spent. And to be honest, I think this place is known for their apple juice. It's like an apple juice that comes with a little fizz on top. No, beer, no beer. it's apple juice. It's beer, apple juice. Beer, it's beer. It's it looks beer. A apple juice, I beer. think it's called. I think it's called apple juice. And some vibes. We got apple juice on sale for seven dollars and fifty cents don't mind the fifty cents the pretend it's not there but that is fifty nine dollars yeah 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 look at this i got an apple juice and it says this guy you can see the little guy it says this guy needs a beer apple juice oh my goodness foam designing that's crazy you actually pay fifty nine dollars on the dot on the dot it's not just two Okay, okay. So it's be more than $59. okay, I'm a little stressed about no, like, that. I was actually surprised actually it's $59. <laughs> it's a nice bar you took me out. My last day was you in Toronto. Honestly guys, it's sad. These are more than vlogs, they're life they're lessons. Life lessons. Give us one, Geek. It's my last day with my best friend. I'm just very, very sad. And sadness is the key to failure. <laughs> so don't be sad and drink apple juice. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Some big dot kebab. Dot kebab. It's what $59 gets you. Shout out to James Bro, Harden. They got us wet napkins. That's a wet napkin. Open it. Yeah, I know. But it's crazy fancy stuff. I've never had wet napkins. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, it's a sad day, ladies and gentlemen. Very sad. Dr. Hobbs is leaving us. It's the next day. It's the next morning. Yeah, the next morning after you spent money. We ha you, you I, I, I spent money. Yeah, so you, just, you treated me. I just said that you treated me last Oh, night. you're being nicer because we're leaving? I'm going to miss you. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I miss you, bro. Um, you're going to come back when? Tell the people. On Jazz birthday. The people cool. won't see you for a while, so give them a yeah. nice motivational You guys won't see me for about two, three weeks. That means two videos. No, Ryan posts a lot. So that means like <laughs> six, seven videos. But I will be back. And the thing is, when you don't see someone for a while, you miss them. So you come back with a different energy. You, you know? come back stronger. Let's go, buddy. Yes! No, 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 oh. you can't leave. You we cannot can leave. leave. You cannot oh. leave. Oh. Oh. Here's my twin. Stay, 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 oh. stay, Jad, stay. Gee, you can leave. I'm just kidding. I'm gonna actually miss you, bro. Subscribe to Dr. Hobbs if you haven't already. Yes, you can see me from the different uh, perspective. Part of the world. Yeah. Perspective. perspective. We're only four hours away, though. But Jazz here. So. I'm here, guys. I gotta <laughs> stay. Gee, you know, me good. I gotta stay, bro. I'll see you, Dr. I'll see you, man. Subscribe to Dr. Sad moment, guys. Seriously, very he sad. really helped us out moving in, kicking it here. I feel like he got you know, comfortable in Toronto too. I got very comfortable. All right, give us uh, three streets in Toronto. There's oh, there's um Harlow, right? 
Oh, and Union. Carla. Carla. Union. Union is. Is it a street? Yeah, yeah it's a rap Raptors, station. Raptors. Oh, Raptors, that's the Raptors basketball team. Raptors. That's more of the basketball team. We'll work on that. We'll work on that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I need to know more. So we'll do that. Oh, oh. Jane and Finch. Hey. Oh, let's go, baby. Uh, yes. no, I, don't, I, live, I don't live there. <laughs> Bye, Guy.